Space flight results in many negative health effects, and the causes may include microgravity, uh, radiation, or isolation and stress. At the Johnson Space Center, we have laboratories dedicated to investigating each of these phenomena. I work in the immunology laboratory, which studies the human immune system and how it may change during spaceflight. The immune system is a variety of different cell types uh, throughout the body. They fight infection and are also important for maintaining proper physiology. The immune system can be negatively affected uh, by many of the factors associated with flight. Uh, microgravity itself may directly inhibit uh, immune cell function. Uh, stress has a profound effect on the immune system, which is why we're more susceptible to illness when we're stressed out. And proper nutrition is important for maintaining a healthy immune system. We're very interested in how the immune system changes during spaceflight and determining if it increases crew health risks during exploration class missions. NASA's just completed a successful immune study on board ISS, which collected blood and saliva samples from astronauts and returned them to the ground for terrestrial analysis. The results indicate that in astronauts, there are interesting alterations in the immune system that persist for the duration of an ISS mission. Uh, this includes diminished capacity of these cells to respond, interruptions in sleep cycles, uh, increases in stress hormone levels, and all of this results in the persistent reactivation of viruses. Uh, so this is not widespread illness among the crew, but interesting research findings that raise our concern for these deep space exploration class missions. For the future, we're designing the next generation of immune studies, which will complete the characterization of the immune system during spaceflight and allow us to proceed to the evaluation of countermeasures if they're necessary. Uh, countermeasures may include nutritional supplementation or pharmacological intervention, or even things like radiation shielding or uh, exercise will have benefits on the immune system. Studies of how spaceflight affects the immune system may provide benefits to Earth-based medicine. This includes information on how stress causes immune system changes in healthy adults, changes that may precede disease. <laughs>